Hello friends, happy Friday. Uh, quick, unusual Friday afternoon video for you all. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, if you saw the post earlier, uh, we're going to be doing an auction tomorrow. And I wanted to give you a heads up on this and uh, already start to thank some folks. I announced this this morning and the, uh, the response has been overwhelming already. Uh, so let me give you the background. A friend of ours, a member of the YTPC, a member of the Instagram pipe community and the YouTube pipe community, uh, has fallen on hard times and uh, I'm not at liberty to say who the person is. They were uncomfortable uh, with me doing this. They frankly have not asked for help. I've volunteered help. Um, but they are in trouble. They are going to be evicted from their home. Uh, it's going to happen in a little over a week and I think we can help them. Now, this is someone that I, I've known for a while, uh, quite a while. Uh, I've spoken with them about this and about many other things, and uh, over the past month or so, have, have had multiple conversations about the events leading up to this problem that they have. I know that they've been trying. They've been trying very hard to avoid this. They've been doing everything they can. Um, still they're trying and, uh, you know, sometimes we get in these situations in life where we just need a hand and this is a case where someone we know needs a hand. So what I would like to do is have an auction for them. Uh, I'm going to do this tomorrow, which is uh, Saturday, December 3rd. We're going to do it at 11 a.m. Eastern and that is, uh, Bear Wolf and Miss Kathy's time slot. They generously have allowed me to use that time slot. So thank you, uh, Steve and Kathy, much appreciated. Um, the items for auction, I only have a few of them in hand because this is happening very quickly. And you know, most of them are gonna be sent by the person auctioning, but I'll show you what I have and then I'll tell you about some of the others. So I have several, um, I think tobacco that will be of interest. Uh, so we've got uh, Gawith and Hogarth Black Irish Triss. This is a 50 gram sealed pouch uh, from 2020, um, which of course is still available but hard to find. I have uh, a tin of McCraney Red Ribbon. This is, I believe, no longer available. This is from 2015. Uh, I think this was produced using McClellan Virginias, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Um, I'm not a Virginia guy, but this is one of the most sought after uh, Virginia flakes and, or Virginia ribbons, I guess I should say, not a flake. Um, it's apparently very good. So uh, it's an opportunity to get a tobacco that you just can't get anymore. And to up the stakes a bit, I have a 2015 tin of McClellan Christmas cheer, which uh, I'm not a Virginia guy, but I've enjoyed this in the past. And uh, you can't go wrong with McClellan Christmas cheer, even if you're not a Virginia smoker. And of course, this is no longer available. Uh, and 2015's got, uh, what's that, seven years of age on it. Uh, put it away for a couple more years till it's 10. and or open it now, doesn't matter. So these are going to be auctioned off individually and, and I'm, I'm still torn over this because I, I don't think this is ready for prime time, but I've decided given the circumstances that I'm going to throw in cane rod pipes number two. This is the second official pipe that I've made, uh, unsmoked, of course, uh, slightly tall billiard. I wouldn't quite call it stacked, but it's taller than it should be. Um, Fit and finish are good. I, I'll touch it up a bit. I can put some more polish on the stem and you know just check it over and make sure it's ready for public consumption. All I can say about this is pipe number zero and number one. I smoke a lot and I'm very happy with them. So if this is in the same ballpark, I think you'll be very happy with it. Uh, if nothing else, it's a curiosity. I will stamp it. I haven't stamped any pipes yet, so this will be the first one I stamp. I'll stamp it with uh, cane rod pipes and uh, the number two, since this is number two. And uh, who knows, this might be the last pipe I make because I haven't started number three yet. Um, so if nothing else, it'll be a curiosity for your pipe wreck. So those will all be auctioned off. In addition, I have gotten some amazing um, donations. 
Uh, so, and I'm not going to name people because I won't remember them right now. I will, as we go through the auction on Saturday, uh, recognize all the folks that have donated. But I have so far uh, an unsmoked Peterson Dracula, uh, an unsmoked Grey Woody, a 1963 Dunhill uh, Billiard Restored, uh, unsmoked Parker uh, from the 70s, another 1970s that I cannot remember, unsmoked, so new old stock, uh, 10 pipe, pipe rack, uh, beautiful, brand new pipe rack. Um, multiple tins of tobacco, uh, plum pudding, Penzance. Sorry, I'm blanking on some of the others, but uh, oh, um, no, that, that's that's all I'm willing to, to remember right now. Uh, another good friend of mine from one of the Instagram pipe community is, has said he will donate some tobacco. I, he doesn't know what yet, but his cellar is amazing and it's going to be good stuff. So this is a great, uh, great opportunity to get some really good, hard to find tobaccos or really nice pipes and help out a friend. So I hope you'll join me tomorrow, 11 a.m. Eastern time, uh, right here on YouTube. It'll be a live stream. And uh, I'll look forward to seeing you. And, you know, we, we all need help sometimes. We, sometimes it's, we need a little hand. Sometimes we need a big hand. You know, it was brought home to me quite vividly over the past couple of weeks with some of the stuff that I've gone through. And so many people reached out to help me and, you know, give me a hand up and lift my spirits. And it meant the world to me. And... You know, I think to myself sometimes, why do I have so many people watching these videos? Why do 60 people spend their Friday nights watching me sit in my basement and smoke a pipe? Uh, it doesn't make sense. And I think, you know, I, I worry about doing these kind of things, and I don't do them very often. But I think, if nothing else, if I can bring some good out of that, if I can bring some people together to help someone in need, to give someone that hand up that we all at some point in our life need, then that makes it worthwhile to me. And I hope that, you know, you guys have meant the world to me over the past couple of weeks and what I've gone through. Now we can come together and mean the world to someone else. So let's do that, guys. I will see you tonight on the live stream, and I hope to see you tomorrow at 11 o'clock on, uh, on the auction. If you would like to donate and you, you know, don't want to buy any of the things or you don't think you can, you know, bid those dollar amounts, you know, $5 helps. You can leave a donation uh, at PayPal, canerodpiper at gmail.com. Uh, you can uh, send that just in the comments, indicate that it's for the auction, so I can sort things out. Um, that would be wonderful. And again, any dollar amount is, is more than welcome. So thank you for that. Um, I will update this video later once I have all the auction items in it, so there'll be a list of everything that's going to be auctioned on Saturday if you want to come back and check in on that. And when I schedule the live stream for Saturday, which will be late tonight, I'll probably add it in there as well. So anyway, hope to see you then. Hope to see you tonight uh, on the live stream. And with that, uh, take care and thank you all. Goodbye now. Mm -hmm.